Greetings, Satish's YouTube. It's Adrian here. How's everyone doing today? Hope you guys are all doing fantastic. Welcome to a new video today. We're gonna be going into the Goodwill. So this is another episode of Goodwill Hunting. And if you guys love like thrifting and thrift hauls and vlogs, don't forget to subscribe so be updated when I do post new videos. And don't forget to check out um, my Instagram and Facebook. It's Adrian. Just like it's spelled here. And check out my shop. It's Adrian.com to see what I have for sale from my thrifting adventures. But without further ado, let's go into the store and see what we can find. All right, they have this patent Dooney 25. This Michael Kors for 30. Adrian Vitadino. Cole Hunt for 25. This is actually like a nice big size. Oh, look at this. These are 20, gonna be like $25, because they're half off. Here's a little kid's bed. I'm sorry about my voice, you guys, I'm kind of losing it, so. <laughs> Just bear with me. These $30 Michael Kors heels. Check out this painting on here, this is kind of cool. $15. It's like Mod Podge done. Alright, I'm checking out some of the bags that they had behind the register. There's this Kate Spade, 30. I think this Michael Kors is also 30. Which is cute. And then this other one. I don't know why I like this little side table so much. It is really cool. It's $40. Oh, it's just like printed, I think. But look at the base on there. All right, the last time I was here, someone asked me to purchase a book for them. And it was like the Cats of Italy or France or something. I just remember it was like a cat. Um, I'll know it when I see it, but I don't think it's here anymore. But we'll see. I actually love this book series. I used to read it. I know it's like a, probably like a teen, preteen kind of book. And it used to just be like a regular like chapter book. I guess they kind of made it into this that has like pictures and stuff. And I think that's so cool. It's only $5.99, which is an awesome price for this because it's originally $25. I might pick this up because I don't know if Cade will read it, but I think my little cousin will. She loves to read a lot, and she loves Harry Potter, so she might like that. But still looking for that cat book. I'm looking at this Martha Stewart book. I wonder if my mom has this. She might not. $7.99. Not a bad price for this either. This one's originally 75 bucks. I found this Rachel Ashwell Interiors. $9.99 for this one. This one's pretty too shabby chic. Cute. Oh my gosh, this pram. <sighs> $30. Virtual reality. This is like a cool print. This one is $7.99. This printer. Oh my gosh. Is that Madeline? It is. That little doll. Oh no. Oh, this old fan is like really cool just for like a like design aesthetic kind of standpoint. That is really, I wonder if it still works. That would be really cool if it did. I found the fan, it goes for about like 38 dollars ish 44 around like $30 to $40. And here it's $9.99, it's really, really a cute fan. It's kinda cool. Oh, and this old picture is also cool. $7.99 for this, with the frame and the picture. All right, you guys, just at the store, I got some really good stuff. I'll share with you guys what I got when we get home. Hey guys, okay, so we're back at the house, and 
It's been a few days later and my voice is still gone, kind of, but it's coming back slowly but surely. But I had to film this haul for you guys so that I could include this in the end of the video. So here we are, back in my room. So sorry about the lighting, I know it looks a little janky. Um, I really need more lights. I'm gonna get on that. But, I'm really excited to share with you guys what I got. So the store that we went to was a Goodwill Boutique. And you guys know how much I love the Boutique. And I know not it's not everyone's cup of tea. But I, 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 I do love them, and I think that you can still find some amazing things inside those stores. So I'm here to share with you guys what I got. So the first thing was this Martha Stewart entertaining um, book, A Year of Celebration, Martha Stewart. My mom loves Martha Stewart, and... I feel like my mom is like the Asian Martha Stewart. Like my mom is amazing. And my mom like loves Martha Stewart. She's probably like one of her favorite people too. Martha Stewart. Um, if you guys know Nigella Lawson, that like a book that came out like in 2000, I think like 2002 maybe is when it came out and it was called um, Nigella, like it was How to Become a Domestic Goddess. And that was like my mom and my like theme book of our lives. It was the best title, the best, like, the amaz most amazing food, and then, like, I think that was, like, one of the pivotal, like, she's always loved cooking at a food network, but, like, the time that book came out, I think, like, that was, like, a turning point in our lives as far as food. I don't know why. Like, I don't know why it just made such a huge statement in my brain, but I think it's just the title. Like, I love books, too, so I think that might have, that might have played a big role in that, but anyway. Back to this book, it also has a beautiful floral design on the back, which I am obsessed with. And this book was originally $75, right there. And I got it for $7.99. So what a savings, and it's a hardbound book, it's in great condition. There's a little bit of wrinkling of the dust jacket on the front, but that's totally okay. Um, but. The book itself is in fantastic condition. The pictures inside are beautiful. And who doesn't want to have like a Martha Stewart party? Like, I want Martha Stewart to be my best friend. I feel like my mom and Martha Stewart would totally get along. And I feel like I would totally get along with Martha Stewart too. So if Martha, if you ever watch this, I love you so much. <laughs> okay, that's enough of that. Um, the next item that I have here is this really cool handbag. Now, what was this again? Oh yeah, lamb. Okay, this is a lamb bag. So excited about it because it is fantastic. Um, if you guys don't know about lamb, it is a brand that was started by Gwen Stefani. Um, she was the lead, lead singer in No Doubt. Then she branched off for her own to have her own amazing musical career. She was on The Voice. She's dating Blake Shelton, also from The Voice. And yeah, so amazing beautiful handbag she actually stopped making handbags a few years ago so finding her bags is really rare and i don't know why she stopped making bags because they're still like they're like so beautiful and amazing this one is no exception and what's great about this from other bags that i found by her is that this bag is literally in like new condition it is stunning i love the gray and the black combination it has a crossbody strap which is in here which um attaches on either side and I love that the hardware on this is a matte black which is rare in and of itself as well so rare lamb bag rare black hardware rare that it's in such amazing condition like it's literally like new like I brought it like I just got it from the department store and this one was a little bit pricey at $30 but I think it is well worth every penny this bag is stunning so this is gonna go up in the shop if anyone's interested it's hadrian.com i know we have a couple lamb lovers out there as well and i'm definitely on that list too and this is such a stunning handbag so there's that and then i have one last handbag to share with you guys and this one <coughs> excuse me is beautiful i love it and i love this style from uh, michael kors if you can see, you can see it has all these beautiful studs along the front. Um, it looks just like um, the studs on my McQueen clutch that I have, which is gorgeous. So, silver studs. It has this little MK dongle on there. And this is a Safiano leather, so it's nice and sturdy. And in like, it, this bag is so gorgeous. The interior 
is in a beautiful shape. The only thing is the handles have a slight bit of wear. Just um, need to redo some of the edge coating on the handles, but that is a quick and easy fix, which I will probably do in a handbag rehab video or um, in a vlog. Let me know down below if you guys want like a more of a formal tutorial or if you if I can just do like a kind of more, more informal thing inside the vlog. Like let me know. Um, comment down below and yeah, because I think I've already done like a formal video on how to repair edge coating, so, um, and this one isn't like too major either, it's just like a little bit, like literally like an inch on each handle, it's like it's not the, yeah, so. This is going to round out today's haul. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. I hope you had fun going to the thrift store and checking out what I got. If you guys did enjoy the video, please give it a big thumbs up. It helps immensely. And let me know down below what your favorite item was that I got. Let me know down below if you think that I should have bought something that I didn't get. And let me know if you guys found anything really cool recently. I love hearing your finds. The bag just jumped off the table. Um, but thank you guys again. And um, I love you. See you guys. See you guys. See you guys all tomorrow. Bye. <laughs> Hey guys, let's check out the handbags. Look at this coach bag, this one's kind of interesting. It's a little dirty though, which is unfortunate. Let's see how much this is. Oh, it's, oh, it's $20. A little too dirty, you might not get cleaned up that well. What is this, a fake Chanel for $20? There you go.